Praise the Lord. Raise up your hands to Jesus. Lord, my Father, as you promised in your word, as you promised in your word, we have many things to pray for. And I said in the beginning of this session, service, that is today, whatever we pray, we are going to receive it there and then. It was not my word. It was your word. Dear Lord King of Glory. It was not my word. The professor was not mine. It was yours. It's me to proclaim. And it's you to fulfill. It's me to prophesy. It's you to fulfill the prophecy. Father at night I pray in the name of Jesus. May you fulfill whatever I pray for these people. May you bring to pass each and everything I pray for them. According to your word, according to your everlasting word, your unfailing word. You say to us that whatever we pray, we are going to receive there and then. And tonight many people have testified that some of them have received instant healing. Have received the houses, lands, salaries. Thank you, Jesus, for that. Thank you, Jehovah. And many of these ones are, have not yet received it. Oh, Lord, King of Glory, this is what I pray for. This is what I pray, O King of Glory. There is only one thing I have right now, and which you told me to pray for them, that will attract other miracles. That will pull by force other miracles. And there is nothing else than the Holy Spirit. Father, the person who is filled with your spirit it has the anointing to pull money from abroad. Has the anointing to pull the money from America. The money will look for her, for him, not him to look for money. He will be found by money. He will be found by favor. He will be found by rich people. He will be found by favorite, famous people in the name of Jesus. The blessing will come in his way. They will call him. The blessed ones will call them. This is what I pray for, O King of Glory. That may you release your supernatural anointing. That attracts miracles. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. May you release your strong wave of the spirit. That brings people to prosperity. In the name of Jesus Christ. May you bring your everlasting love. That leads people to love them. Your people will love these people. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Today let us receive that spirit. As you say that we shall pray and we receive instantly. May we receive your spirit right now. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Let no one go back the same again. Let no one go without the spirit. In the name of Jesus Christ. I command the spirit of the Lord to fill your head. To fill your heart. To fill your body. To fill your house. To fill your business. To fill each and everything you have. Wherever you, you touch on will be a blessing. You will be a blessing wherever you go. In the name of Jesus Christ. You will touch much money. You will touch uncountable money. Amount of the money you have. You will never know it. God is going to surprise you. Receive the miracle. In the name of Jesus, Father, I command that according to your will and according to your prophecy, according to your covenant, according to your unfailing love and unfailing grace and word. In the name of Jesus Christ, I command miracles to fall like rain in your house, in your family, in your life. In the name of Jesus Christ, receive the anointing of the Spirit of the Lord. Receive the anointing of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I command the angels, the heavenly angels to, to protect them. Yesterday, Lord, I, you showed me here in the church. You showed me that the angels are already in the place. And they are going to put our miracles where they are supposed to be. May you please, Father, open our eyes and see those angels. And see where they are putting our properties, our things, our money, our blessing, our, our businesses. In the name of Jesus Christ, our favor. May you open our eyes, O King of Glory. Open these people's eyes. Open the people's eyes all over the world. In the name of Jesus to see 
where their miracles are. May you di direct them. Direct these people. Direct them in the name of Jesus Christ. They have raised their hands to not to me, but to you, O King of Glory. You are the one who has everything we need. And I just thank you. According to you, what you told me, you say in your word in Mark chapter 11, verse 24, that whatever we pray in your name, we have already received it. Father, you did not touch anyone. You did not touch anyone in the upper room. When the apostles were praying, when they were gathering, you touched no one. But they were filled with your spirit. May you fill them with your spirit. May some of these people speak in tongues, different languages. I pray that gift in the name of Jesus Christ. So that they reveal your secrets of the heaven to them in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. Because when I pray, you always hear me. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. May you clap your hands to the Almighty Father, the Creator, the King of the Universe. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. May God bless you abundantly in the precious name of Jesus Christ. May God bless you. Thank you.